Hi guys, this is Vlad from the tech team. Just a quick video, a uh, video guide on how to set up and prepare this uh, new Draga Infinity for patient use. So, to switch it on, press the button, and then we have to wait for about a minute to start up. Okay, so this is the initial screen, and we just need to close this window. Okay, so now what you need to do is to have a look in the system check. If the device check has been done recently, so it's 29th of March and today is 1st of April, so that's fine. Okay, the only thing left for you to do now is to do a breathing circuit check. So we're going to go over here and just follow the instructions on the screen. It says breathing circuit check, please start. Press start. You need to confirm here on a knob. Okay, so connect breathing circuit, seal patient connection port, confirm with OK. So the breathing circuit is connected and the patient end is occluded. Yeah, so we can press OK. So now the machine is performing the leakage test. Okay, open patient connection port, confirm with OK. Okay, so I've opened the patient end. Now I'm gonna confirm with OK. And that's all. Now machine is ready for patient use. All right, so even if you have this alarm saying perform device and breathing circuit check, please ignore it for now. Press alarm, reset, and then confirm it over here. So now to start the ventilator, you go to standby and here you can start for new adult or pediatric, yeah? So this ventilator can do high flow as well. So if you want to switch from normal ventilation to high flow oxygen, you press over here, you confirm and then if you want to start, you press start. Confirm again. So now in, we are in high flow with a flow of 2 liters per minute. Okay, just to show you, we can go up to 50. Yeah, we confirm it. We have 50 liters a minute now. To go back to normal mode of ventilation, yeah, we're going to press standby here. Put it on standby. Confirm. Okay, we're in standby mode. We're just gonna reset the alarm. So you can notice that every change on the ventilator needs to be confirmed by pressing the knob. So now, let's say we're going to the ventilation modes. Gonna switch to ventilation. Press OK. Then here, if you go ventilation settings, you can select your mode of ventilation and you can change your settings on ventilation. For example, if you go here, which is PC, pressure control BiPAP, which is actually a bi-level, let's say we want these settings, okay? We confirm, yeah? Then we close the window here, then we start the ventilation by confirming here. All right, so that's a quick guide, yeah? About how to connect, how to do the checks, and how to connect it to the patient.